because you know I'm a Muslim and I watched in and Sumerian they 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 they, they prayed like this too back then. That's it. That's probably where it came from. This and wow. this and this and then your knees and I said, Wow. Right. That was Islam before Islam was thousands of years before. <laughs> Hey, do me gang, what is poppin'? This is Adam Saleh and I am back with another video. I just landed here in LA. It's about to be a wild journey, so stay tuned to do me gang. I hope you all are having an amazing day because I'm having an amazing morning. So if I'm having an amazing morning, you all should be having an amazing, happy morning. We're about to go to our Airbnb. I'm about to introduce you guys who's here with me. It's the whole Brooklyn squad. So make sure you guys give this video a giant thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next shot. Let's get it. Do me, gang. We got Mo and the Key. Yo, what's what's poppin', baby? We in LA, man. man. What's good? excited to be in LA, man. It's been a Yo, while. So we're about to rent a car. We just left the bus and Slim left his bag, man. Look. Bro, this dude always leaves, so now we're taking it. He doesn't even know we have it. <laughs> Let's see if he notices it, bro. Yeah, yeah, I have a feeling we won't notice until we're at our Airbnb. <laughs> and he's trying to find his bag. So. Slim still doesn't notice. Neither does Sophia notice. Bro, not even Khaled notice. What? You don't notice nothing? What? They don't notice anything. No, they don't notice anything. It's Slim's bag. It's, it's, it's a bad thing. Yeah? It's a bad thing. It's a bad thing. Slim left his bag, he doesn't even know. Oh, wow. <laughs> We're just waiting to see when he notices, that's it. My bag, my bag! <laughs> yo, yo the, the best part is that he'll blame us for not getting it. <laughs> He's on his phone, like... It's the car that we got. So do you feel lighter or something? Or no? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you don't feel lighter? No. Ah, yeah, we just got here. Oh! What? What's that? Man, <laughs> yo, you know what? Play active courtesy, man. Seriously, yeah, all, of our lug <laughs> all of our luggage is about to fall out the back. <laughs> what what Slim like and so man, they got us feeling like we're the president. Seriously, man. What, 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 what kind of car is this, Slim? Oh, it's suburban and uh, first of all, and so, oh, yeah, see what's on. Alhamdulillah, it's good. Right. Yeah. <laughs> see what's on. Put your phone down and play active courtesy and let's fine. get it. In and out, one mile away. In and out, it's the first thing we do. In and out, one mile away. Let's go. You just been in and out. Who are you? Don't pour energy. Where the fuck's the energy? In and out, baby. Let's go. It do me gang, we just got to our Airbnb. Slim still doesn't know that his bag is not with him. Man, this guy is so goofy. I'm just gonna wait until he notices. We're about to go to the barbershop right now, get a cut. It's our first day here. We're just gonna freshen up, chill, relax, get our rest. We're kind of jet lag. Brooklyn boys are jet lag. But it's about to be an amazing week at Doomy Yang. Stay tuned. My song is coming out and music video is coming out. Valentine's Day, we'll be filming it here in LA. It's actually my first time ever filming a proper music video in America. Usually I'm always in Australia or UK or Dubai filming my music videos. So I'm so excited for this one to be in LA. Nadumi gang, as I told you guys, you guys are in for a treat. Oh, Nikivo yeah. vibes oh, out here, man. Oh, man. Yo, man. Yo, should, should, should I tell them the uh, song name? Nah, nah, don't say the song name. Uh, Valentine? Nah. Yeah, nah, don't say it, don't say it. Come on, come on, man. You trying to expose my ish? No. I'm excited for it though, man. Yo, you're not hiding that? It's so hot here, man, right? I love the heat, man. I miss the heat. I know. I don't mind sitting here for hours. Well, look, man, the palm trees and everything, just beautiful. It was wild, bro. We came all the way out to LA and they got a poster of New York City on the wall. Oh my God, we're not trying to see New York, man. <laughs> take, but we need to take this thing off. We're not okay, trying to see New York. Don't bring it up. <laughs> we're not trying to see New York. We're trying to see LA. Hey, do me, gang. I just got done getting my cut. Slim still doesn't know that his luggage is with me. Thank you so much, my brother. You too. My G. Huh? Yo, you guys see my double bag? What's up, like? My blue double bag. It's actually one. Let me do blue double bag. Huh? I see. I'm not sure, but I can't forget it, honestly. Where? Oh my god, bro. I had mad porn stuff in there. What up? You left what? Something like double bag. You left it where, bro? You didn't bring it with you here? Yo. What? Yo. Something. Yeah, dumbass. You left it in the airport? You didn't bring it with you. You didn't. Carry with you. My double bag? Yeah. I'm trying to think right now. Oh my. Damn, bro. I had my laptop in there and everything, bro. We had. I'm going. I have to go. Some. Some. What do you have in there? What you have in there? My laptop. My. My camera. Laptop. I had everything. Why are you always not looking when you take your stuff, bro? Damn, bro. Man, clumsy, man. Khaled, why are you telling him? Oh my god. It's a fucking terrible start, man. What the hell? I know, Od. This guy is such an idiot, man. Well, look, like, he's an idiot. Why is he my best friend? He said it's a terrible start. He don't know that we saved him, and we got his back. So yeah. What if? 
Sam, why are you looking at the thing like it's the balcony, like it's there? Like, it fell out when you were driving the car? Bro, the back of the car opened. Yo, his bag is right here. No, I didn't want to live with that. You see this one? No? Give me, give me, give me. Look at that. I have all my stuff in there. Shit, get back to that. Oh, man, it's a terrible start to the beginning of the freaking trip, bro. God! We can't stop some bro. Damn, bro. Damn, this is just ruined my whole energy, bro. Damn, son. Wallah, look to your right. Honestly, you don't you don't even say thank you or nothing, but you don't you leave your bag and oh, you, I'm gonna say thank you for you taking my bag. I we, give it back. We, we we found your bag. You left yeah. it at the bus. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I felt bad when he said terrible start, man. It's not a terrible start. Let's yeah. get it, baby. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Go. Let's go. Let's go. Yo, we're missing Wakas. We just getting started, baby. Let's get it. We'll see ya. Yo. Get your bag next time, son. I got it. Yeah, so. I got it and I'm hiding from you guys now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it do me, gang. So I finally just took a shower. I freshened up. I feel so much better. I was feeling a little jet lag. But alhamdulillah, I'm feeling good. It is about to be a long, productive week. It do me, gang. So stay tuned. Make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram, Adam Saleh, to see all the behind the scenes and see everything before the vlog is up. I appreciate you guys for watching my videos every single day. So I was watching Mike Tyson's podcast with Ryan Garcia. He is an undefeated professional boxer. I hosted the KSI versus Logan fight with Ryan Garcia. And to see him now doing a podcast with Mike Tyson is insane. And do me, gang, and to all the viewers who are watching, just out of curiosity, let me know who do you think will win in this super fight. Ryan Garcia or Tank? Davis. You see, the thing is, me and Slim, we met Ryan Garcia, and we met Tank Davis. I think I know who will win, but I'm not going to say it. Who do you guys think will win that fight? Ryan Garcia, who is so fast, or Tank Davis, who is also really fast, but has knockout killer power? I have no comments, so let me know on my Instagram. I'm just really curious and interested to see what you guys think. I'm just a really big boxing fan. But anyways, while I was watching the podcast, Mike Tyson was spitting some real, real stuff, and he started giving Ryan Garcia and and his co-host, some Dawa. I'm gonna show you guys what he said. Matter of fact, let's pull it out. Let's watch it together, baby. Let's do it. His name is changed all the way to Jesus, Prophet Muhammad. Yeah. Um, you know, um, so many different Indian gods. But at one time, there were Sumerian gods, and they were the same story, but they're different names. Mm -hmm. And then they turned into Roman and Cre and Greek and American and African. Now we're all the same. But at one time, these same deities, Jesus, Prophet, Muhammad, they were different gods. They got their religion from these gods. Because, you know, I'm a Muslim, and I watched in and Sumerian, they, 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 they prayed like this too back then. I said, that's probably where it came from. This, and wow. this, and this, and I ain't these. And I said, wow. Right. That was this long before the time was a thousand years before it even existed. Right. Wow. So, you know, religion is in, we know nothing about God, but that it exists in us. Yeah. It, God exists in us. Yes. Yeah. Just bottom line. Our brain is not sophisticated enough to fathom God. Wow. He didn't make us that way. When he said the Sumerians used to pray like this, they used to pray like this and have prayers like this and like that. And that existed before Islam was even Islam. That just shows that Islam is the truth like what what is there there's so much stuff that shows that islam is the truth and to the people that say that islam is not the truth they're literally just haters of islam but man mike tyson is speaking facts let's continue watching it because he still continues talking about islam and saying that he's a muslim and i love that so much about mike tyson he is a proud muslim while i was watching this i seen his co-host who was jewish he kept mentioning how he was jewish ryan garcia mentioning that he was catholic and i was waiting for mike tyson to mention that he was muslim on his live podcast and he did so i honestly made my day and it made me so proud let's continue you watching we're never gonna have like an understanding it's just you gotta you know you gotta know that god is forever he's like, to me it's like change it's always change 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 evolve change, change. and god's rules what you think our rules are. Really, I know you read, know you read the book, hey, but God rules basically what humans think they are. Hell yeah, you know, regardless of what we do behind closed doors. You know, our, our, religion, um, our religion doesn't stop our humanity, doesn't, you know, form our humanity either. We, we come from savages, and we're taught to behave and act like this. Mm. We didn't just um, we evolved this way. 
we're taught to be this way because if we didn't act this way, we'd get punished. Uh, wow. It's probably hundreds of thousands of years ago. We went to but some people evolve more than others, and some people stay out of animals. I have the animal gene. That's why we have serial killers. You know, they don't always um, reform to the human status of following the law and stuff like that. Yeah. Do you guys feel like when everything aligns, like for instance, when you're in the ring and everything's come to fruition and you're totally present and you're on the, your highest vibration, that you're closer to God? I'm only close to God when I'm alone. Wow. You know? Mm. I don't feel him. When, I don't feel him when I'm in the ring. So I put my ego in the ring. Mm. I only, I only experience God when I'm in the presence of quietness and silence. Wow. But you did say the gods of war have ignited your ego. Yes, but that's that's some tickets, nigga. I love my understand, like some yeah. stuff is just to get the people going. I don't gotta yeah. use my ego to take advantage of my ego. Stop letting my ego take advantage of me. Right. You know. And you, everyone has to be quiet and go inward. And we all pray to different gods, but that doesn't mean that someone else's God is any more or less legitimate than yours. Listen, no we no we no we worship. We worship the characteristics of God. And the characteristics of God is in all the books. Wow. You know? That's just what it is. Yeah. When it's characteristic I, I you know, I have the characteristics of a whole bunch of religions. But I'm a Muslim. But you know, if I was just a straight Muslim and didn't know any other religion, then I wouldn't be a wise Muslim. Wow, I really only was thinking about my religion. I have to understand everyone else as well. Right. I'm not the only I'm not the only person in the world. I have to understand the world. And the, the, to understand life. He left them speechless. He literally gave them dawah saying that he learned a lot more about other religions. And he is not just saying this like from just learning about Islam. He learned about all other religions. And it shows that all other religions, they worship the characteristics of God. So that is just amazing, man. Seeing Mike Tyson giving Ryan Garcia that one, man. This is just beautiful. May Allah bless you, Mike Tyson. But man, I am super excited for this fight, man. I really hope Tank Davis is also on his podcast. It's gonna be a crazy, crazy fight, at Doomy Gang. But you know what else is gonna be a crazy fight? The Slat Unboxing event this year, Doomy Gang. So stay tuned. Me and Slim, we have a huge announcement to make in a few weeks, and it involves boxing. For now, we are just chilling, training. I have a song coming out, Valentine's Day. Do not forget. If you guys want to know the name of the song, thumbs up this video. Let's see how many of you guys want to know the name of the song. If this video gets 10,000 thumbs up in 24 hours, I will let you guys know the name of the song tomorrow, in tomorrow's vlog. If not, then I'm going to save it until I'm allowed to. So do me gang. I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If y'all did, make sure you guys smash that like button. And do not forget to subscribe. I love you guys so much. And I'll see y'all tomorrow. Do me gang. Take care and peace. I love you. Girl, you know you cold Why you leave my heart on freeze? You kept me warm like summer Soon as I fall, you leave Maybe it's just a dream And when